Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Spencer. Uh, today we are going to be opening box 3 of 12 from my latest uh, PSA returns submission. And I will be going over the quality of the card and then revealing the grades and seeing if they uh, match up pretty well with uh, the person who graded them from PSA. Um, sometimes they're a little bit off, but majority of the time they're pretty good. Uh, sometimes it's just, I have no idea why the card got the grade it did because it, the condition of the card did not warrant the grade they got. Okay, so I guess let's get started. Okay, this card. There is a white mark on the top left corner. It is definitely off-centered, thicker on the right, thin on the left, if you guys can see that. And which card is it? Dark Slow Bro, the non-hollow first edition. Check out the background. There is someone from Team Rocket right there. Yeah, it's a little bit off-centered, thicker on the left, thin on the right. But no scratches or dents that I can see. Okay. And what do we get? Mint 9. Okay. Yeah. Majority of these cards should all be Mint 9 or Gem Mint 10. I mean, none of these cards have been touched since they were opened from booster packs uh, way back in whatever year this came out. 2000? Yeah, these have been in sleeves and in my binder since 2000 when we got the booster box. Right, so corner a little bit of whitening, a little thicker on the right than on the left, and another dark slow bro first edition. Okay, front looks pretty clean, a little thicker on the left, and what do we get? Another mint nine. Okay, next card. Uh, some white marks here. Um, uh, that is pretty much it. And Dark Vial Plume, non holographic. No scratches, dents, or blemishes. A little thick on the left, a little thinner on the right. And we got Gem in 10. Okay. Alright, so our first one. Okay, next card. Corners look pretty clean, uh, it's pretty centered. And this is Dark Weezing, first edition, non-hollow. Front looks clean. No scratches, no dents. This has got to be a gem in 10. Let's see what we got. Gem in 10. All right. Okay, next card. Some whitening on this corner, on these two also. Centering looks pretty good. Another Dark Weezing. Okay. No scratches, no dents. This one, it's a pretty good chance at a 10. Uh, let's see what we got. Gem in 10. Okay. Next card. Uh, it's a little thicker on the right. Uh, some whitening on the corners. Oh, Dark Charmeleon, first edition. This one costs a little bit more because of the Charizard tax that I've heard about. <laughs> Basically, a lot of Pokemon cards are raising in value because Charizard cards are also increasing in value. Okay, let's see what we got. Mint 9. Okay, let's see. Corners have some white marks, thinner on the left. Thicker on the right. Dark Dragon here. I really like this art. This one looks pretty good. And I actually like Dragon Air a lot more than Dragon Knight. I don't know why the, the art that they drew or why Dratini is like that evolves into Dragon Air and then Dragon Knight has arms and legs. Hmm. Looks pretty clean. All right, what do we get? Mint nine, okay. Next card. 
Uh, looks decent. Some whitening on the edges and the corners on this side. A little whitening on the corner here too. And dark electrode. Front looks pretty clean. I don't see any scratches or dents, blemishes anywhere. Okay, what do we get? Mint 9. Okay. Alright, next up. Yeah, this one has whitening on the corners and the edge on there. Dark Flareon. Yep, anybody here collect the uh, Evolutions, as they're called? Let's see. What do we get here? Mint 9. Okay. So yeah, like I said in a previous video, um, I guess when I finish uh, revealing all of my PSA cards, whichever stack is bigger of 8s, 9s, or 10s, I'm going to be uh, selling them as a single lot, basically a bundle. Um, I'll have it listed on eBay, but if you guys are interested in, I guess, collecting and trying to complete a PSA 9 set, um, yeah, just uh, message me and we can probably work out a deal. Alright, next card, it's pretty thin on the left, thicker on the right, some white marks on the corners. Dark Gloom. Front looks pretty clean. And what do we get? Gem in 10. Alright. Next up. This one is off-centered. Uh, some white marks here, white mark there. Thinner on the left, thick on the right. Some white marks on the bottom here. And it's a dark gold duck. And it's pretty centered. No scratches or dents that I can see. And we got Mint 9. Okay, next card. Yeah, this one, there's a bunch of whitening on the edges. White on this corner here, white on the bottom corner. Let's see, Dark Jolteon. Another evolution. And we got Mint 9. Okay, next card. Slightly thin on the left and thicker on the right. Some white marks on the corners. And dark cadabra. Front looks pretty clean. What do we get? Gem in 10. Sweet. Okay. Next card. Alright, some edge wear on the left. White mark here. Uh, centering looks pretty good. And dark machoke. Yeah, the front looks pretty clean. No scratches or dents that I can see. Let's see what we got. Gem in 10. Okay, next card. Some white marks here, white marks there. And I don't know what is, why is it all white right here? Okay. Next car, I mean, let's see what it is on the front. Dark muck looks pretty clean to me. All right, what do we get? Mint nine. Okay, next up, some white marks on the edges here, on the corners, some on the edges here too. Dark Persian. And the front looks clean. There's a black speck right there. I don't, I don't think that's a stain or anything. Alright, what do we get? Mint 9. Okay, next card. Some white marks up here on that corner too. Some on, yeah, right here on the side corner. Dark Primeape. Front looks clean. It's pretty centered. And what do we get? Four? What? How is this a four? Wow, what? I don't see... I honestly don't see anything on here that would 
warrant a PSA 4? What? Okay. I do not see anything at all. Okay, well, if you guys saw anything there, let me know. I pff, can't find anything on there. Okay, next card. Uh, edges, whites, a little bit on the corners. Dark Rapidash. I think there's an error on this one, but... Okay, yeah, this one... Yeah, it says it's missing the word length right here. As you can see, as compared to the other cards, it says length. Yeah, I remember that I specifically uh, saved this one in another hard case because this one was an error. I don't know if they ever fixed it, but this one is missing the word length in it. Okay. Yeah, let me know if you guys have an idea or if you guys know the answer, if there is a corrected version of this. Let's see. Looks pretty clean. Yeah, it's just that whitening on the top. But yeah, I don't know if it's wear, but it could be just from when it was cut. Okay, and we got Mint 9. Okay, next card. Uh, it's thicker on the right, thinner on the left. There is some white marks on the corners. Dark War Turtle. And edges look clean. Yeah, this one's pretty good condition. And we got a mint nine. Huh. Okay. So, last card of this box. Let's see. Corner has some whitenings. Edges look pretty clean. <laughs> Everybody's favorite Magikarp. Front looks pretty clean, maybe a little thicker on the right, a little thin on the left. And what do we get? Mint 9, okay. Yeah, this this one I really, I, I don't understand. This one they gave it a 4, but I don't see any, any errors, any mistakes, any major flaws that would give it a 4. Yeah. Anything that's a PSA 4 is like, it's been played with and you would see a ton of wear on the sides and corners, on both sides even. Okay, well, let me know what you guys think about today's video. Uh, leave a comment below. Uh, if you guys are interested in picking up any of these cards, you can check out my eBay store or you can message me directly. Alright guys, don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.